So yeah, John Cusack plays a serial killer in, in this movie. And I knew after being in so many bad movies he'd finally crack. I mean, here we are. <laughs> And piano. So Grand Piano stars John Cusack, it stars Elijah Wood, and yeah, I didn't really know anything about Grand Piano. When I saw the trailer, I was like, yeah, that looks really, really intriguing and good, and uh, yeah, I saw the movie, and this is one really entertaining movie. I really loved most of this movie. Why? Because most of the dialogue fe feels like so real, and you really get to know Elijah Wood's character, and just the dialogue is just like so fast and quick and it just feels like it's real like you feel like you're in the situation that he's in and the movie just pulls it off really really well this movie was extremely unpredictable like i was surprised at how unpredictable this movie was it was just like like it everything happened so fast and i couldn't really tell what was going to happen next and that's when you got a really really good movie i really like the simple concept of this movie a lot of wood's character is this famous piano player he messed up on this supposedly unplayable song and so when he gets to the next concert that he's going to perform that unplayable song on his sheet music he sees written down is uh, John Cusack pointing a sniper at him saying that if he messes up he's going to murder him and Elijah Wood is basically really nervous throughout the entire movie and yeah I really enjoyed this movie this movie was like so intense so enjoyable so fast-paced and it's just a really fun thrill ride even though the end of this movie is kind of cliche, it really, like, the entire movie as a whole completely derives from any cliches, and it really feels like it would come out in, like, the 1980s. Like, even the poster looks like it could come out in the 1980s. It looks really cool. And, yeah, I just really like, like, everything about this movie. This movie is filmed so well, too. Like, there's such, like, there's tons of, like, long shots and the the camera like never stops moving it's like always like going around Elijah Wood like playing his piano and you can tell that Elijah Wood is really actually good at playing piano and the soundtrack for this movie is really good guys this is one of the best soundtracks I've heard in a while it's it's a really good soundtrack the entire soundtrack is completely made up of orchestras and it's really really well done I was surprised overall I really really enjoyed myself like more than I thought I would I thought I was just gonna see a cheap thriller that had junk Cusack in it and it was just gonna be dumb but in the end this is a really fun and intense and really inventive thriller that I would not mind seeing again yeah this is one of my favorite movies of the year yeah Grand Piano is getting a 9 out of 10 it's it's really intense and like creative at the same time and just puts together to make a really satisfying movie. So comment below and let me know if you're seeing this movie and uh, if you've seen it, what do you think about it? It's available to rent right now. Guys, this is one of the best direct-to-DVD movies I've ever seen. Go out and watch this movie. So anyway, guys, uh, wait, one second. Hello? You have to make the most satisfying ending to any of your videos right now or I will kill you. Uh, okay. Um... This is Pigaloy signing off. <laughs>